ಸ್ವರವರಮ ಶಿವ ಸಮಾರಂಭಾಶಕ್ತಿಮಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರ I welcome you all with my love and respects and blessings. Today I want to introduce direct words of Paramashiva given to Parashakti on the enlightened civilization. How an enlightened civilization, Hindu nation, should exist. Paramashiva has elaborately with 139 chapters detailed accounts manual for emperors and welfare of the nation in Akasha Bhairava Tantra the book is called Sri Samrajya Lakshmi Pitika it's a elaborate description of paramashiva by paramashiva to parvati parashakti how an enlightened civilization should exist how the fort for the leader should be how the prince princesses should be how the constitution what should be the constitution and how the whole flow should function the quality skills lifestyle of the ministers different sections of the society oh god if you see the details unimaginable daily routine self culture of the head of the state and for the whole welfare of the hill kingdom whole kingdom workings of each department of the nation and the state and how to run successful administration of the nation i tell you still enlightened civilization kailasa exists inside the kailasa hill please understand the kailasa hill in tibet arunachala hill in tibet ಅರುಣಾಚಲ ಹಿಲ್ ಇನ್ ತಿರುವಣ್ಣಾಮಲೈ ತಮಿಳುನಾಡು ತಿರುಪ್ಪರಂಗುನ್ರಂ ಹಿಲ್ ಇನ್ ಮಧುರೈ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಯು ಥಿಂಕ್ ಎ ಸ್ಟ್ರಕ್ಚರ್ ಇನ್ ಸೈಡ್ ದ ಎನ್ಲೈಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಿವಿಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂಸ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟ್ ಟನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರೆಫರೆನ್ಸಸ್ ಬೈ ದ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಾಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟ್ as recently as ramana maharishi ramana maharishi says inside arunachala hill the arunagiri yogeshwara is sitting and running the whole enlightened civilization he says he himself has gone in many time and experience stayed with them lived with them and came out of course i have my own experience atma pramana with ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಆಪ್ತ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಅನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಮೈ ಓನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಐ ಗಿವ್ ಯು ದ ಗ್ಯಾರಂಟಿ ಎನ್ಲೈಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಿವಿಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ ಕೈಲಾಸ ಇನ್ ತಿಬೆತ್ ತಿರುವಣ್ಣಾಮಲೈ ಇನ್ ತಮಿಳ್ನಾಡು ತಿರುಪ್ಪರಂಗುನ್ರಂ ಇನ್ ಮಧುರೈ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ ಕನೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದಿಸ್ ಎನ್ಲೈಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಿವಿಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ that enlightened civilization manifests as the hindu nation for the human beings who are living on the planet earth so this samrajya lakshmi pitika from akasha bhairava tantra is enlightened civilization mapping itself on hindu nation how to create 
for the human beings an enlightened civilization. Understand? Inside Kailasa, Arunachala, Tiruparangundram, some more places. Paramashiva, Rishis, Munis, Kailayavasis, Siddha, Rishi, Muni, Kinnara, Kimburuda, Gandharva, Gandhara, Yaksha, Rakshasa, Sura, Asura, all of them, how they live an enlightened civilization with oneness with Paramashiva, that principle of oneness is mapped into an understanding in this Sri Samrajya Lakshmi Pitika of Akasha Bhairava Tantra by Paramashiva to create Hindu nation. Understand? The elaborate instruction how a fort should be built from there. The designs. The whole thing, the deity representing the power and glory of the state, Samrajya Lakshmi, description of her temple and the divine routine and puja, everything so elaborately, so beautifully is described. So from today, in our Gurukul, this book will be a, one of the important subjects because our Gurukul is created to create enlightened kings and queens, enlightened prince and princesses. It's not just created to have just an enlightened beings, no. Enlightened kings. The aim of my Gurukul is enlightened prince, princesses to revive this enlightened civilization and Hindu Rashtra, Hindu nation. So, we have many Adinavasis, Kailayavasis in Adi Kailash who know Sanskrit. Start teaching this from today. From today, Samrajya Lakshmi Pitiga from Akasha Bhairava Tantra becomes a syllabus for our whole Gurukul. Gurukul was not created just with the purpose of creating enlightened beings or enlightened sannyasis or enlightened pitadibhatis. It is created for enlightened pitadishwars. Means enlightened sannyasi kings and queens. So my kids should learn this Tantra, Akasha Bhairava Tantra, Samraj Lakshmi Pitika. The book is already translated in French, but I don't think it is translated in English or Tamil, any other languages. But it is already translated in French. But we have enough people who know Sanskrit in Adi Kailash. We have many Sanskrit postgraduates. You can start teaching. From today, this book, worship, even relief work, how overcoming calamity should be, how invasion should be handled, how war should be waged, everything, city planning, construction of the state, everything so beautifully and celebration, how the Ashtaiswaryas should be. How various should be selected? How commanders should be selected? How ministers and administrators should, should be selected? Whole thing. How the institutions for charity should be established? How temple should be established? How daily prayers should be established? Oh God, what an elaborate description. How he runs the enlightened civilization inside Kailasa, Arunachala, Tiruparangundram, he has described beautifully in this Akasha Bhairava Tantra. So this will be our foundation work. This will be the foundation for the revival of the Kailasa, the enlightened civilization. So naturally it will be the greatest nation guiding and setting a trend for all the nations on the planet earth to follow. 
and enjoy get enlightened it's so beautiful such elaborate details and how the king's coronation should be done how the raja bhavana nirmana lakshana and the throne raja simhasana arogana and the deities which are supposed to be in the hall and the coronation ceremony simhasana nirmana pratishtha vidhi simhasana arogana everything so beautifully <laughs> and how the head of the nation should be giving darshan to the citizens after the coronation to that detail i think it is time the gurukul my prince and princesses start learning this science how the 72 groups of retinue uh, follows and 64 arts that the king and the ministers administers elites of the king's government should be adopt in and signs of manifesting wealth everything everything and is so beautifully described and so this book forms foundation fundamental for the kailasa reviving the enlightened civilization the hindu nation so this book also should be printed in palm leaf kept in all our temples embassies as the foundation constitution of the kailasa directly taught by paramashiva to parvati revealed by paramashiva to parvati so this book forms the foundation fundamental constitution work and then we will be adding some more like manusmriti even paramashiva himself has revealed some more dharma sutras and smritis all that will be added so this book will form the foundation of the constitution of the kailasa cosmic constitution and elaborately the festivals which need to be celebrated each month how the charity should be done and charitable institution should be established it is just how the physical exercise should be done how the dance should be done who oh god it's it is just a, the vision document of paramashiva how he is running the kailasa the enlightened civilization is unimaginable let's listen to him and live as per his vision let's make his vision reality it is <laughs> it is so beautiful and he describes about the tuladanam tulabaram shodasa mahadana dasaparvat dana meru dana jnaneeshwarya karavidya vishesha dana and pilgrimage what all raja tirtha yatra sangalpa tirtha yatra phala swarupa everything how an army should go with the chariots elephant cops cavalry charioteer sarathi lakshana ah such elaborate description so we are uploading this book today in the internet you can all download and learn if you know sanskrit soon we will upload the english translation the gurukul should start this as a class today from today the class on sri samrajya lakshmi peetika the book from akasha bhairava tantra starts in our gurukuls and it can be made even online classes so all over the world all the gurukuls universities who want to become my prince and princesses can start learning so you can also enroll if you want to become my prince and princesses and any parents if you want your children to be prince and princess of, of kailasa you can send an email to 
contact at kailasa.org we will train your child so contact at kailasa.org we will open the prince princess training classes on campus and online both if any parents want on campus training you are welcome but one parent should be there with the child with a full legal custody and be there in adi kailash for on campus training and all the kids in the adi kailash are going to be future prince and princesses so this agama should be immediately printed by all temples either in palm leaf or in paper and kept in puja from today from today all temples start for shipping this agama in a printed form and bound form the whole verses all the verses will be uploaded immediately so from kailash website please download kailash digital nation sorry we can't use the word website it is too small word from kailash digital nation you can download and print it and keep it in all temples for worship every day it should be worship remembered as the constitution of the revival of enlightened civilization kailasa so classes will start from today in adi kailasa and online also the classes will be available every day the classes will be happening because training the prince and princesses is too important job for reviving the kailasa the enlightened civilization anybody who is below 21 can enroll for this class online anybody below 21 can join on campus class to be prince and princesses the moment you join the class you will be given the title prince on training the under training prince under training princess for kailasa the revival of enlightened civilization this book becomes the foundation even for the people who want to become spiritual ambassadors of kailasa should learn this book should read this book if you want to be spiritual ambassador of kailasa please send an email you will get the copy of this book e copy digital copy you should start reading understanding the principles so let's get ready to revive the kailasa enlightened civilization as visualized envisioned by paramashiva as revealed by paramashiva to parashakti and let's do the work i bless you all let's all radiate with integrity authenticity responsibility enriching casting living shuddhat vaita saivam paramashivoham the eternal bliss nityananda thank you be blissful